like. To raise awareness about the health of our planet, City News first introduced you to Montreal McGill University professor Larry Lassard in July at the start of his mission in France. Update, he's now halfway through his 400-day journey, joining us from North Bangkok. Halfway mark, 11,000 kilometers. I've, been, uh, I've done 15 presentations so far. <laughs> It's been a smooth ride for the mechanical engineering professor, losing his camera, one of the only bumps in the road he's faced. Still have my bicycle, my bicycle still works. So I really have nothing to complain about. Friends have ridden alongside him and many catch-up Zoom calls take place. Despite the fact that it's a solo journey, I'm never lonely, so... Miss my family, of course. His son now joining him in Thailand, taking rest days from biking. Mm. But come January 6th, the pedaling resumes. My mission is to create awareness about recycling, sustainability, but I think I'm adding a lot of world peace along the way. The Bike 62 initiative has gained traction, getting invited to speak at more places than planned. As you go down, there's just endless uh, street food. Presenting his work during talks at universities and wind turbine sites, discussing recycling and reusing compost materials like fiberglass and carbon fiber. I want to do my part to help heal the planet. And along the ride, he's also surrounded by culture, sparking friendships and having adventures within his adventure. So here we have uh, spiders, centipedes, <laughs> always better with soy sauce. Look at that baby. His low CO2 emission journey fueling other research too. He's being monitored by a doctor researching the effects of extreme exercise on a person in their 60s. Once you start something, you gotta finish it. The 20,000 kilometer ride being documented by Lassard, hoping to keep inspiring once he's rolled back into Montreal by the summer. Because everyone seems to be very nice. It's very hopeful for the world. But everyone is so nice everywhere. In Montreal, Pamela Pagano, City News.